told you. Oh, yeah. He's like, I needed to have that talk with him because he said you guys hadn't really connected yeah. and he wanted yeah. to connect with you. Mm -hmm. And because I always tell, I swear to God, I always tell him, like, if you talk to Eric at all, he's like, no, Amber, I'm like, you need to. Yeah, I'm like, I, so I, cool. I, I, I grabbed him and we talked for like probably an hour and a half. And I, I you know, I can only, you can you, all you can do in this house is take your own impressions on things or whatever. And yeah, I thought it was an awesome talk. He's, I, yeah, I really, he's exactly, he's really, I, I really felt really good about it. But you know, and he's like, you're right. I'm like, I told you. I'm like, I don't know what the problem. Because I asked him, like, why don't you and Eric ever talk? And he's like, what do you think about Eric? And I'm like, honestly, Eric's a cool guy. I've had nice conversations with him. Like, he makes me laugh. He does funny things. I said, you know, he's like every, all the whole package all in one. And I said, you know, I said you need to talk to him. And he's like, I know I do. He's like, I want to. I just don't know how to approach well, it. I think as I. As I said, some of the the very initial peripheral um, connections faded fast, and for the most part, in my case, the people that I got to get to know a little bit slower and later than everyone else are some of the people that I'm making actually the best connections with ultimately, and that's what I keep telling people, three days is like doesn't yeah, mean anything. No, no, this no, is no. A, it's really a much longer experience and people open up and connect in a different time frame in a different way and uh, a lot of the people that I'm still developing my relationships with are, are the people that I actually feel best about and some of the people that out of the gates I was all buddy-buddy with, I'm like, you know, yeah, totally. not, <laughs> pretty much already kind of crapped out for me, you know. Um, the thing that's really weird like in this situation though is the way that as far as at least it's explained to me, which probably means nothing or whatever, the way that the votes like seem like they're breaking down strike me as like strange. Like the people who are like on one side versus the people on the other side don't add up to what I see going on in the house and like things like that or whatever. Mm -hmm. It just seems a little bit all over the map to me or whatever. Um, you know, it came to my attention. You know, I, I, we we're all fully aware. Like you know, I, I had a day or two where I was. Uh, I had a few minor tiffs and, and was the slop was getting to me and, and people were getting to me and I think in one or two cases I was wrong and I think in one or two cases yeah. the other people were very much wrong. Um, but during that time frame I started getting like totally freaked about like, you know, my place in everything and this and that and how I was being perceived. And you know, I got a hold of a couple people who I felt were being straight with mm -hmm. me or whatever. And they just gave me the most ludicrous shit about what alleged alliances I could possibly have and, and how I'm all, and I have all this up my sleeve and all this up my sleeve. And it, the whole thing made me furious because it shows that it doesn't matter what you're doing in reality because it's really only how people are perceiving what you're doing that really matters because it was every last thing that I was being told was totally inaccurate. It's just ridiculous. And I was just thinking to myself like, this I don't like, because if this is what people are, like, thinking about me, then people are fucking wrong. But they'll still hold it against me nonetheless or whatever. And um, I think there are some definite misperceptions as to, like, what uh, alleged j agenda. And I think what people need to realize is just because they're overplaying and making asses of themselves this week doesn't mean everybody is. And I'm not one of the people who's doing that. I'm, God forbid trying to get to know the people I'm going to be living with for the next three months mm -hmm. and trying to learn what there is to learn about them so that way when I do come to a time that I'm making decisions that are meaningful in the game, like I, I actually have, you know, a foundation to make these decisions on, mm -hmm. not just, you know, come in on day one and make 15 different fucking alliances and 10 secret alliances and have secret codes and, I mean... Some of these people are driving me fucking bonkers already. I, I, I can't fucking take it. And they're so rude oh some of them also. I know. I, know, that, you know, I, know I don't want, I'm not going to make you, you know, commit to saying that or whatever. But I'll tell you, there are people in the house that are fucking rude to me. And, um, and I think it's funny because those people are going to leave. And they're going to leave soon. Mm -hmm. And it's just a horrible, horrible way to play the game. And when you think, you start getting yourself, yo. You okay for company? Uh, give us like five, maybe. We can never be alone here. And for you? What? Oh God! <laughs> Hi, honey. We'll join. You. Oh my God! <laughs> Please. Ooh, damn. What the hell's going on? Please be there. I'm sorry. I don't want to make it like no. awkward for you or no. whatever. But Eric, listen to me. I don't. I want to tell you something, and I mean this, okay? I don't care. Like, if I'm talking in a deep conversation mm -hmm. with Dustin or anybody else and you feel like you are, you are never interrupting me. Like, I, 
it means a lot to me that like that you told me that you know that you feel like you can come to me like that means a lot to me you know what I mean I just want you to know I don't care like you will never you don't ever bother me you, I, I don't ever like I'm think, sure I can bother you no you don't <laughs> at all you never do you always make me laugh like I, I want you to, to really know that I mean and I mean this when I tell you this like you can talk to me if you need any I don't care you can trust me I'm not gonna repeat what you tell me I'm just telling you this for future I'm not saying you know say I, yeah. if someone's bothering you and, and you, you don't want to say their name that's fine but if someone's bothering you and you want to be like I fucking can't stand you know Dustin he da 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 I'm not if you tell me please don't say anything I'm never you have my word well, of well, honor listen, the way I, I am about this is I'm not about repeating things that people don't want to repeat and I